Earth Signs, how are you? How are you, my loves? So let's see what's going on with you, Capricorn. Capricorn. Seriously? Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. <laughs> what's going on? Something about commitment, something about making commitments, leaving commitments. Um, being having a hard time leaving commitments. Uh, there's this uh, feeling of like, um, well, it's not the change. It's not so much about change. It's sort of like, where do my huh, loyalties lie? There's a uh, that's a good thing that this card came up because this is about control, okay? And that is about resisting new opportunities, resisting things, worried about things. There's your Taurus right there, right there. Um, somebody could be resisting um, or worried about a commitment, worried about twin energy, worried about that. Okay, the other person is doing their manifesting work. They're doing their, they're doing what they're supposed to be doing. They may not be talking to you about it. They will. Okay, within um, eight days, two weeks here. They will talk to you about it. So you can work together on it. There's something here about um, being in connection with your guides and following your own path and the expectations of, that's the control part here with the emperor, expectations of how it's supposed to be. expectations about what relationships are supposed to look like and how this is kind of making you freaked out because maybe it doesn't look that way okay so you're expecting a commitment this is twin flame energy you're expecting a married relationship you're expecting this person to be a mirror uh, husband this is husband okay partner right if you're if you're a man watching this uh, a very strong partner, wife, husband, wife. You're expecting that. This person is more on the path of uh, change, personal change, personal empowerment. Um, uh, magician, eight of wands, six of wands. They're going through their own battles, okay? They're going through their own stuff. They're working on manifesting things. They're working on their own it's like that story. I'm not sure which video I told the story in, but when I was at the Monroe Institute, fabulous, by the way, totally recommend it. Uh, I was there for the New Year's program. I was walking the labyrinth and I saw this one turkey vulture flying. And then I saw the second one come in. And it was like very um, beautiful energy. They were totally independent. They weren't inhibiting each other. They were free to fly wherever they wanted to fly, but they came back together they fly away and they come back together and they fly away. And it was just like they were touching base with each other. They weren't inhibiting the other one from doing, being free. There's freedom, freedom and connectivity, connectedness. This is a transformation wheel moving forward and something you might resist in the beginning because you're not used to it, earth sign. You're not used to this, uh, but you, it will be a co- creative experience not a codependent one allowing the other person to expand into their talents gifts life okay without you worrying about like oh what did i do wrong they're not calling me right it's sort of like not that it's got to be balanced okay there's got to be a balance here of togetherness and freedom And the universe has your back here. It's, it's about that. Balancing togetherness and freedom. And that's something that it's, it's difficult for someone who is, you know, uh, traditionally earth sign, being super grounded. But this is a new experience for you. This is something that is a very new kind of love. That's this twin flame piece now is about being interdependent but not codependent okay not codependent no more of that I'm just gonna get one here and then we'll move on to the extended all right 
Yep. <laughs> okay. Yes. <laughs> that's, you know, that's the, um, what's the word? It's sort of like, it's a sink. It's a, it's a yes. It, what, whatever I just said about being uh, interdependent, not codependent. Yes. That's what this is about. It's about changing the kind of vibe of the relationship. Manifesting freedom, yet being connected. Cool. All right, guys. We're going to do an extended read. The link is below. Capricorn Taurus Virgo. I will. The link is below in the description box if you don't know. Okay. I'll see you on the other side. <laughs>